Hi, I'm Ray Young. I'm Vice President for Education with the Sarasota Sister Cities Association and today I'm going to be continuing with our discussion of some of the specific sister cities. Uh, last time we uh, discussed Perpignan, France and Telmon, Israel and today I'm going to give some background information on Dunfermline, Scotland and Shaman, China. Uh, Dunfermline, Scotland became a sister city in 2002. Um, the location of Dunfermline is got across the Firth of Forth in Fife from Edinburgh. Uh, it's a small, smaller city. Uh, it's the hometown of Andrew Carnegie, uh, the great philanthropist uh, in the United States, a Scot who immigrated to the U.S. And it's important to note that uh, Sarasota was founded by the Scots. Uh, John Gillespie from, uh, from Scotland was Sarasota's first mayor, and he established the first nine-hole golf course in Sarasota, which may be one of the first golf courses in America and certainly in Florida. Um, it's the location of the 1,100-year-old uh, abbey, the Dunfermline Abbey, which is a, a beautiful uh, abbey in this city. Well, why Dunfermline, Scotland is a sister city? Well, our Mertz Theatre Opera House stage is from uh, the Opera House in Dunfermline, Scotland, our Mertz Theatre stage uh, in the Mertz Theatre at the Florida Studio Theatres out by the Ringling Museum. So the uh, theatre became uh, uh, in disrepair in Dunfermline, Scotland and it was uh, purchased by the uh, city of Sarasota, actually by the uh, Florida State University. Uh, it existed as an opera house in Dunfermline from 1903 to 1983 as an existing structure and then you can see it fell into disrepair by the slides I've shown here. Uh, it was in pretty bad sh shape. Uh, they packaged it up and stored it, and it became uh, known that it was available, and it was purchased in 1986 by the Florida Studio Theater for a half a million dollars. Uh, and then it opened as the Mertz stage in the Florida Studio Theater Performing Arts uh, Center at a cost of uh, roughly $15 million. And it is a beautiful theater. And I should note that when I was in Dunfermline, everybody seems to know that we have their opera house. Even the bus driver said, you know, you have our opera house in Sarasota. So, but they're very proud to have it here. And uh, you can see that it's a beautiful theater existing uh, in Sarasota. Uh, so Dunfermline has the similar traits. Uh, it's in similar size to the Sarasota city. Uh, they have similar interest in the arts. Uh, and it's supported by the uh, Caledonian Club of West Florida. Uh, we've also had a number of uh, art displays from Dunfermline. Uh, the artist Malcolm Robinson has several sculpt sculptures. Uh, we're, we, he had one on the, uh, on the waterfront, on the bayfront. Uh, we have an annual show there. And he has a permanent sculpture at the uh, Fruitville Library, which you may want to take a look at. We've also had a number of, ex of exchanges with Dunfermline, Scotland. Uh, the Boy Scouts from Dunfermline came to Sarasota and uh, we showed them around. This is a picture of the group on the top right. And we've also sent uh, Girl Scouts to Dun Dunfermline. We've also had uh, multiple winners for the Florida Studio Theater uh, competition, as I mentioned in, a in the previous uh, presentation. And uh, some of the girls shown in the background are some of the winners uh, when we visited Dunfermline. Uh, we took a picture of them. Some of them have grown up quite a bit from the days they won the award. Uh, the boy in the center is a bagpiper, uh, Daniel Ferry, and we invited him uh, to come and perform with the Kilty Band in Sarasota uh, last year in 2016. And, uh, he did a wonderful job and he practiced ex extensively with the uh, Kilty Band every morning in Sarasota while the week he was here and performed at their annual uh, performance in the evening. We have also had uh, choral ex uh, music exchanges. The Key Chorale performed uh, in Dunfermline, Scotland at their Carnegie Hall. They still have a Carnegie Hall there. And uh, that's Richard Storm uh, with the group, and uh, they were well received uh, in performing in uh, Dunfermline, Scotland. We had a delegation tour to Dunfermline in 2016, in August of 2016, and shown here is our delegation. In the center is the acting provost for the uh, the 
Fife, the County Fife in Dunfermline, where, uh, where Dunfermline exists. On the left is our former president, Beth Will Hollinger, and on the right is Pauline Mitchell, the city director for Dunfermline, Scotland. We were very well received, and they showed us a film of the uh, dismantling of the their opera house, which uh, was then transferred to Sarasota and uh, with a wonderful reception. Okay, I want to talk about another of our sister cities, Shaman, China, which became a sister city in 2007. Uh, Xiamen's lo located in the south. Uh, if you look at Beijing in the north, it's directly, roughly directly south. Uh, it's uh, right on the Sea of China, uh, right across from Taiwan. You can actually see Taiwan from Xiamen. It has awards as a green city and China's most romantic leisure city, which we could also say about Sarasota as Florida's most romantic leisure city. Uh, it is the ancestral home of, of more overseas Chinese than any other province in China, and it has a number of similar traits. The ge geography and subtropical climate are quite similar, a clean environment, an educational center. They have a large University of Xiamen, very much uh, emphasizing visual and performing arts, certainly a tourism center on the south and the south of China, and it's an investment in commercial exchange p potential there with uh, Sarasota. Uh, they also have a botanical garden similar to our Selby, uh, Marie Selby Botanical Garden. There's a somewhat larger, but here are some scenes from their Wanxi Botanical Garden in Xiamen, which is a wonderful place to spend time as it is in the Selby Garden in Sarasota. This is the signing agreement of the mayors while we visited uh, Xiamen in 2007. That was our acting, our, our current mayor at the time, Mayor Luann Palmer, who's been a very strong supporter of Sarasota Sister Cities over the many years, almost since its inception. And she's uh, being greeted by the mayor and during the ceremony in Xiamen. At the, at the left is Linda Rosenbluth, who is our former president. And next to her is uh, Carolyn Bloomer, the city director for Xiamen, China. Uh, I mentioned embracing our differences, the poster, uh, competition and display on City Island uh, in a previous presentation. The, the embracing our differences uh, is, uh, promotes differences in, in individu individuality and people. And one of the first winners of the contest, you first have to get accepted and then they pick a winner of the whole show. And in the first couple of years, uh, this young Chinese uh, girl from Xiamen, China, Sheng Hong Ying, won the first prize and they were awarded one thousand uh, dollars to her school in Xiamen, China and shown as her poster, her drawing that won the award and of course it was a big uh, big honor for her, the, her school and her in China and you can see she's being received with a bouquet of flowers uh, in Xiamen, China after the announcement of the award. We've also had uh, artist exchanges with Xiamen, China uh, we, we, for two weeks each in each city, uh, Lu Ping, Lu Ping, and Zhen Shenglong uh, came to Sarasota for two weeks, and shown on the left. And there's Carolyn Bloomer with the two uh, visiting artists, as well as Irene Leung, who was the assistant city director at the time. And then we sent two of our artists from Sarasota to Xiamen for two weeks. Uh, Robert Farber from the Fine Arts Chair at Ringling College went there as well as Javier Rodriguez, an independent artist, and they're shown in Xiamen, China. And as part of the program, we request that they give a, a, a showing of their work, and Robert Farber showed his work at the uh, Ken Mitchell Gallery in Englewood in uh, 2012 after he returned, and that was a well-received reception. We've also had music performances. I mentioned earlier that Hope Burns performed in Xiamen, China during our delegation visit in 2007, and George Gao has performed here uh, from Xiamen, uh, China. We've had, as I mentioned, we've had artist exchanges with uh, Xiamen, China, embracing our differences, uh, entries, and winners, Florida studio winners uh, in, uh, from Xiamen, China, and these music exchanges. There you can see the group from delegation from Xiamen, China, when they visited Sarasota for their signing. And you can see how proudly they're looking at their tree in the Millennial Tree Walk in Sarasota. Uh, they, they were very proud to have their presence here in Sarasota. Okay, that concludes my uh, third uh, in a series of presentations about 
our sister cities, in this case, uh, Xiamen, China, and Dunfermline, Scotland. And in my next presentation, I'll talk about our sister cities of Treviso, Merida, and Rappersville, Jonah. Thank you.